It may look a bit rough around the edges, but this device is working to help keep pupils safe at a Skogamraig Furness in Llanelli. It was built by the pupils themselves to help clean the air, made from a high-powered fan and some special filters, with a little help from Dr Rhys Thomas, a consultant at Glanguilly Hospital. He's already developed a breathing device to help COVID patients, which has been used in Bangladesh. I saw Dr. Reese's work um, online and in the papers doing some air purifiers, so I contacted him um, and thought it would be a good idea to have him on board to show the pupils how um, well, the uh, scientific side of things, where how the uh, virus spreads through the air, and also learning the ways of building a um, air purifying machine. Professionally made air purification devices can cost thousands of pounds, but the raw materials for this device cost just over a hundred pounds. And the inventor says it can have a real impact on air quality in our classrooms. So we've got a very powerful fan here on top here. Which 30 units will now be trialled in primary and secondary schools in Ceredigion. I came up with a device along with colleagues in America to um, make a simple device but yet very powerful which is very cheap which the children could actually build themselves to help themselves plans to use ozone machines to disinfect classrooms were abandoned by the welsh government last year after safety concerns these homemade air purifiers are very different and use filters to clean the air so it takes the clean air in uh, the dirty air in through you then it cleans it down you then it sends the clean air up and out it is quite easy to make as long as you've got the right equipment. Uh, it was really, really fun. Uh, I feel really safe, feel really happy, uh, clean air with all these lockdowns. It's very nice. I feel safe in the classroom. A Skolgebraig Furness says it's seen fewer cases of the virus since the purifiers were brought into the classrooms.